Hey y'all, it's me. I'm coming to do a video response to the It Gets Better. Um, I don't really know what to really, or how to really start off this this video by saying, um, you want to say so? Besides that, it's, it gets better. I'm going to start off by saying that, but by saying that, I am 24, and I've been gay since I was little, you know, and I had to grow up, you know, around that, and my my parents didn't accept me at first, being gay, so I was picked a lot in school, I was talked about, you know, I went through many fights and arguments, and it was a lot of nights I was, I felt like I was alone. Nobody to talk to, and you know, I had to build in the encouragement in myself to go on and move and be stronger. Um, you know, when I got eighteen, I moved on my own. You know, and things got better for me because I had to get out there and transition on my own and realize that I'm here. I can't just worry about myself. I want to leave by myself, and can't nobody make me or change me for who I am. I mean, when I got out there, yeah, I started doing drag. I started dressing up and doing the wigs, and, you know, I felt comfortable because it was me. It's who I wanted to be, and it was always somebody, you ain't going to never be nothing. You ain't going to do this. You ain't going to do that. You're going to be dead before you are uh, 24, woo, 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 woo. but I'm glad to say that I'm here today and that I'm 24. And, you know, I might have my little health problems, my little asthma, my little diabetes, or whatever, but I'm still here. And I'm glad of that because a lot of people are about, well, you're going to have AIDS, HIV. No, I have nothing. I'm safe. I've been with a nice, a nice person for seven plus years. We've been happy. We have our ups and downs, but, you know, it's, it, it is what it is. And I want to encourage everyone out there who is. You know, in the closet, who's who wants to come out, but can't don't want to come out because they're scared of what people got to say. Forget what everybody got to say. You are your own person. You have to live for yourself. You have to do what you have to do. I was blessed to run into much love from Kentucky, who took me in and helped me realize a lot of things that is is going to take. It takes for you to accepts you to do things in life. I've been to a lot of stuff in church. I've been talked about it in my church. I have been set down from positions in church because of my sexuality. But I came to conclusion that oh well it's not it's not about what they want, it's about what I want. And I know that I have the answer to it. Like, you know, I'm a Christian. Yes I am. And I know that it is a sin but there's no greater, uh, there's no other greater sin than blaspheming against God, uh, you know, praising another God. So there's no other sin greater than that. But I do ask God to, you know, to protect me for what I be doing and what's going on. But make, make a long story short, if you if you need help, you need guidance, you need someone to talk to, and you out there, you see this video, please feel free to inbox me. I will give you my number. We can talk, you know. We can work it out, and we, you know, I can help you come out of that because I know how it is. I've been there. I have a lot of friends that's there now. They're slowly coming out because they're scared of what they found out. Our friends are going to say. I've opened my door to many of people and let them come and stay with me, you know, and help them get on their feet because they were scared when they when they did tell their friends they got kicked out the house and also. So I know how it is. I mean, if you need somebody to talk to, please, just inbox me. I'll get you to the information that you need. I'll get you to the right phone numbers. If you want to just talk to me, just please contact me. I'm always open. I'm available. Email me. Anything. I hope that this message will help somebody. I love you all, and I hope that you all love me. Until next time, much love from KY, Mother Love, Mother Marion. I should say I'm sorry and mwah.